Mr. Right Kubrick wants to learn how to make the pennies. Yes, okay? these gold pennies are fat. I didn't know that you could make a gold penny. Should we do that, Mark? Should we show him how to make a gold penny? Yes. Okay, so this isn't a chemistry class, all right? So I, sometimes I'll bring you stuff that the high school chemistry teachers are doing. So let me show you the process, and it's, it's very, very cool. Okay. Uh, so first of all, what you do is you take regular copper pennies. So right. here are these copper pennies, and you shine them up a little bit, and we learned that taco sauce does a good job with that with uh, another segment oh, that I've we did. That before. So remember yes. that? So we, we shined them up, and then the secret was this. Tell them, Mark, what is that stuff right there? That's zinc. That is zinc. zinc. You've never seen zinc before. Zinc, it's like oh, a it's dust. A gray powder. Yeah, I it's didn't like a little gray that. powder yeah. that you see there, all right? Okay. So you have to take that. Now, here's where the little danger factor comes in because we've got sodium hydroxide. Oh. That's lye. All yeah, right. right. So sodium hydroxide goes in there, and we're just, of course, using water right now, so you can kind of see what happens. Okay. But you mix the zinc and the sodium hydroxide together, and I want you to take a look at what happens here. You can actually cause that penny to turn silver. It's all silver right? so that's first. A silver look at that. Penny. Looks like a dime right. almost. Right. So, right. but what does it really have on there, Mark? What is it? Zinc. 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 That's exactly right. So it's zinc. Now here comes the cool part. You got to put on your safety glasses for oh, the cool part. Right. Ready? So okay. put on your safety glasses. Right. Put on your safety glasses. Now, Mark, what happens when you take copper and you mix it with zinc? It turns brass. It turns but it into looks brass. Like gold. But it looks like gold. Oh. You're right. So, and the way that we have to do that is we kind of have to fuse it. So as teachers teach uh, kids about alloys, this is what you would see here. Okay. So you ready? So here, watch this. Let me grab one of the little pennies the here. Silver. So silver this is penny. one of the si silver pennies that actually has. Um, zinc on it and now if you watch very carefully we're gonna heat up the penny and you can actually see it start to turn you tell me when it, oh, oh look at that it, it goes to gold would you look at that that is way so cool. is that very very cool that now so I've got a bunch fun. of them in this little uh, tray that's right over here so take a look at the tray and we'll just kind of fire this up so here's a dish okay. and we're just gonna fire up the dish oh, so watch what happens when we heat them up like this so we're actually learning to make an alloy with this so you heat them up like this and you can see uh, kind of that color there it goes there it comes. there's your color change oh, they just, it's just amazing don't they? So, and so they'll turn that way. So again, one of those things that a kid would do in a chemistry class, one of the problems is, that Mark, I was telling you, they're showing up on Google, and they're showing up on Google because people are putting them back into circulation. Right, and you can't put them back into circulation. So you can make your gold pennies and hang on to them.